Good evening, I'm Jill Valley. And I'm Dennis Bragg. One was emotional while the other barely blinked during a hearing where the two suspects of a gruesome double murder pled not guilty to the charges today. We also found out if prosecutors are going to seek the death penalty in this case. MTN's Augusta McDonald joins us live from the Missoula County Courthouse with more. Augusta. All right, thanks, Jill. Dennis, yeah, 26-year-old um, Augustus Standing Rock and 23-year-old Tiffany Pierce could both face life sentences if they're convicted. When the judge was reading those maximum penalties, Pierce actually became emotional, even hugging her attorney as she walked out. But Augustus Standing Rock didn't react. Missoula County Attorney Kirsten Pabst says prosecutors do not plan to seek the death penalty for either suspect. Her reasoning stems from a U.S. Supreme Court decision that deemed Montana's death penalty unconstitutional. Pab says both of the suspects have caused security concerns since their time in jail with complaints about their behavior on file with the detention center. Pierce's attorneys made a motion to have those incident reports sent directly to Pierce and her attorneys instead of getting them from law enforcement or the county attorney's office. They also made a request that Pierce have access to the law library while she is in custody. Prosecutors have one week to respond to both of those motions. The bodies of Missoula residents Marilyn Pickett, age 15, and Jackson Wiles, age 24, were found on August 17th. They had been placed into plastic tubs filled with chemicals. The Missoula County Sheriff's Office reported at that time that the initial investigation indicated that Pickett and Wiles died from stab wounds. Because of complaints from the detention center about Standing Rock's behavior since he's been in jail, prosecutors asked that in the future for future hearings he appear, appear over video instead of in person. This is because prosecutors say that transporting him is now a security concern. However, his attorneys requested that he do appear in person for future hearings because of the severity of the charges that he faces. 